Hey guys, welcome back to your review channel. Today I'm looking at the DJI Mic 2. Now, this video is about how to update the firmware. If you're having some issues with audio, little clipping noises, little it's not really sounding really good, it could be a, your uh, version, your uh, firmware version is probably outdated. Maybe there's some updates and there are. So definitely check it out. I got this about a year ago and there's definitely many updates since then. So I'm gonna show you how to do it really easy. Um, super simple, it's, uh, just watch this video. I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. I'm gonna cut away and I'm gonna show you live right now. I'm gonna do a cut screen. I'm gonna go right to the DJI website. The link will be down below. Click on that link, takes you right to the website where the firmware is, really easy. I'm gonna show you step by step how to do that and that way you can see how to do it and it's just super easy. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead, all you need is basically USB-C uh, to USB-C cable uh, and you're not gonna use the case, you're actually gonna take them out of the case to do this process, okay? Uh, you don't do it in the case, you do them out of the case and you do them individually. You do the um, receiver and then you do the transmitters separately. That's how you have to do it, there's no other option. Now when you get the receiver out of the, out of the box, um, what you wanna do is just navigate to, let me just get here, unlock that, you want know, to navigate to, to the setting, receiver settings and you just wanna scroll over to where it says settings, click on settings and then go scroll over where it says version right there, I'll click on the version. Now, I already updated this version already, um, and I'm just gonna show you the process, and that's how you know it. So just check your version, make sure that it's not updated. It might not be, it depends if you just got it, it could be, or you. they never, sometimes they never do, and you have to do it yourself. So this is updated, but I'm gonna show you how to do it. So the first step you have to do is shut the power off. Shut the power off of the receiver, shut this off, and definitely disconnect this dongle thing. Now, sometimes the, um, the lightning cable messes it up, so take that off. Just disconnect it, take it off, you don't have to do anything. And then what we're gonna do is just plug this right into the computer, to the USB to USB-C, and it'll come up as no name. You'll see that in one second. Let's do the cutaway right now. Okay, so all you have to do at this point is um, super easy to do, just take off this. I would re recommend uh, taking off this dongle, uh, this the uh, lightning dongle, take that off, really easy. Um, make sure this is off. Um, and all you have to do is download if you go right here, the link is down below right here. It takes you right to the page, the DJI page, the link, and you'll see the two firmware updates right here. One's for the receiver and one is for the transmitter. So we're doing the receiver first, take that and hit download and then put it onto your desktop. That's all you have to do. Once you put it on your desktop, you basically drag and drop it into the uh, file that you, uh, into your into your DJI. So let's just talk about that. I'll show you that. And let's just grab that, hit that. There it is, drag and drop it to my desktop, which I did. Okay, so now this is on my desktop right here. Now I'm gonna plug this in, okay? And all you do is just plug it in, and what's gonna happen, it's gonna open up a no name uh, window, and that is your um, DJI right here. You can see that, now you just double click on that, this opens it up the window, you take this file and drag it into here, it doesn't matter where, anywhere, just drag it in there. Once you drag it in there, it'll say up, um, starting update, it'll say updating device. Um, first thing you wanna do is um, disconnect it, so what you wanna do is once you drag and drop that into the file, take the no name and just eject, I already updated it already, so just eject that. Uh, and once you eject it, it'll stop blinking, updating. And I'll show you that cutaway right now. It'll say updating, and when it's finished, like you see here, it'll say update complete, that easy. That's all you have to do, it's simple, it just does it by itself. Now, when you wanna do the transmitters, exact same thing, make sure it's off. All you have to do is download the transmitter one, like you saw in the file, and then plug it in, same exact thing, plug it in, uh, once you plug it in, it'll pop up here, right here. Again, no name, take that no name, right here, it doesn't matter if this DJ, don't worry about that folder, drag and drop the uh, tr transmitter file right into there, exact same thing, you eject it, where is it, I can't see this, okay, there it is, eject, uh, and then once you do that, you turn on the receiver, and basically it'll blink, 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 and then when it stops blinking, it's pretty much all done, it's that easy, it's basically plug and play, drag and drop, and you're done, it's that easy, guys, so that's all you have to do to update your, your um, firmware, make sure you do that, I think it's important, I was having some issues, and some crackling, and some distortion a little bit, and I really think it was because of the firmware update, and I did test it afterwards, and it really sounded really, really good, no issues at all, hey, if I brought you some value, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, I really do appreciate that, it really helps my channel out and I really do appreciate that. Leave some comments down below if this worked for you. I really would appreciate that as well. Leave some comments, like, share, and share this video. It's super important. All right, guys, there's one thing that I want to say to you. Thanks for watching and make it a great day.